Uh, last night I met with my Thursday gaming group and five of us in our late 50s to early 60s um, went through the glooming deep tutorial and we got done about, we started around 7.30, got done about 11.45, were mostly level 11 and we had killed the, all the various mobs in there. One person had to log early, so next week we will finish him up. And then I've got to figure out where I'm going to take uh, my friends for next Thursday at uh, level 11 uh, as we'll be leaving Glooming Deep. It's been a long, long time since I played the, uh, the lower levels. So anyways, as far as the beta is concerned right now... Uh, I'm at level 120 because this is the tier one zones and I want to feel, uh, get a little exploration of how it feels to uh, tackle the mobs at 120. I am, I don't have any maps downloaded. Um, I haven't done any research yet because it's kind of fun just to go in cold and, uh, and check these zones out. This is really the only time in EverQuest where you get to do something like that because I, it definitely uh, peak beforehand. Uh, these are the two quest givers for the mercenary tasks in Lorien's Inn, so I'm getting those quests, and then I'm going to go check out some mobs. And here's, uh, you know, running through the zone. I know I'm in first person. People hate that. Um, it's... You know, it's the way I, I've been doing it for many, many years. And I wasn't really a streamer or a gamer or anything, so I just do what's comfortable to me. And it's comfortable to be in first person when you're running through the zones. There's a lot of sheep and chickens here that are just, uh, as far as I'm concerned, decoration right now at this point. They're not uh, experience-giving mobs, or doesn't seem to be. So I've transitioned to, I killed my first mob, a, a spider, yellow, uh, snareable, didn't summon. And I realized that when I copied over my UI files, I did not copy over the file oh, that has my keybinds. So that was fun, trying to, to make it all work. So I'm going to have to redo all my keybinds. Um, rather than go back and try and figure out which file has the key binds in it and copy that over. Now let's transition to our next fight, now that my key binds are done. And it's another yellow spider. He's snareable. I'm pulling with snare and then sending my pet. I've got my mercenary up. I did try to root rot initially, and my root kept breaking. Um, I don't know if it was me or I was having a bad run, but uh, I gave up. I'm just trying to explore right now and have some fun, and so I've got the mercenary up, and I'm doing pet tanking. It's probably not the best system, right? For instance, I didn't know how long these would take to kill. They've got about 66, 67 million hit points, and I wasn't using wounds uh, initially on this, and that was a mistake because it was taking me about 138 to 145 seconds to kill these spiders. So I'm going to let you see this first spider that I, or not the first, but the second spider that I killed um, after experimenting with root rotting and decided that wasn't going to work for me. And after killing one and realizing that I didn't have my keybinds set up. Got my log parsers up there. He's level 120. Almost max AA. Um, I got some fun things from the uh, the old man, so he's he's well geared, though not uh, not with the latest gear. This is all stuff from uh, Night of Shadows. As I said, I I don't have any maps yet. I haven't done any um, reading. So I just got the mercenary quest. We're pulling them. We're having a little bit of fun. Uh, I have given my pet 
to bright edge weapons, so they're not even the, the best weapons. He seems to tank these really easily. This is the assassin pet. Of course, when I say really easily, I'm, I'm using runes and heals, and we've got a mercenary up there, so... No... Perhaps not as easy as all that. Now we're transitioning to um, a fight where I pulled a red mob. It's level 124. It's a kobold. And uh, he is snareable and he doesn't summon. And he had probably in the neighborhood of 74 million, 75 million hit points. So a few more hit points than the yellow spiders. And I burned him down because I was going to end after this. <laughs> yeah, I, I just this the reason I pulled a red mob um because I I figured well, I'm logging, so let's go ahead and pull something that might be arguably difficult. It, it wasn't that difficult. Again, if you if you're snareable and you don't summon, a necro can kill you. Just depends on what technique you want to use. And in this case, I hit all my burns. <laughs> Not tearing up my pet, but I have a raid focused pet. It's a pretty zone. It's very pretty. It's uh, wide open. It's going to be uh, very busy, I suspect, um, when the new server opens up. Uh, already I see a few people in here. And uh, it'll be crowded. Um, the main thing you'll want to avoid is uh, getting ads. You know, ads always change it and make it a little more difficult. Yeah, just be prepared to deal with those. And that's it. I'll let you go. It's a little quick uh, intro to the beta.